<laughs> it's it, it's it's interesting, Tommy, and I think a lot of people do not realize this. Is Kevin Samuels really he 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 really used a lot of your talking points? And I think the reason yep. why he was able to I think the reason why he was able to have such a far reach and and blow up is because and, and look, it's always been my assertion, Kevin Samuels is just the polished version of Tommy Sotomayor. He's literally you in a suit who says exactly what who said exactly what you said. He just did it a little more civilly. What uh, is yes. is that your assessment? Okay, all right. Yeah, one hundred percent. I um, he used to come to the comment section. Mm -hmm. Used to email me wanting wanting to dress me. Oh wow! Uh, oh, he wanted to, yeah, he wanted to do me like uh, Madonna. He wanted to dress me up. <laughs> and there's nothing wrong with that. Hey man, I mean, look, I didn't. I don't look. You see, you see, how I look right, right, right. I need somebody to dress me up. I don't look good. There's just things I don't do. I'm just a poor man as far as like. I do the basic, basic, basic. I like to, I I like electronics, but other sure, than that, sure. I don't dress very well. My daughter laughs at the way I dress. Everybody laughs at the way I dress. I don't, I, I, dressing has never been my thing. Okay. Um, aesthetics. When I do my shows, I, I had I always had great mics because I came from a recording background. Oh, wow. I did not know as that. Far as, yeah, that's why I got all kind of music that I've been, uh, people were buying my music and I made that music in my 20s. Wow. Um, wow. So you've been around. Listen to it now. The, uh, they buy it off of the band camp, but it's music I made in my 20s. I had all kinds of expensive ass equipment. I had my own studio in my own home in my 20s. God damn. Jesus fucking Christ. So while everybody else was struggling and trying to use YouTube, which I now, don't knock that either. No, of course not. You make your money where you make your money. But I had mine. I didn't right. come into this game looking to make money. Okay. I had it looking to make a change. That's why I said I was Jesus and everybody else Christian. <laughs> so, um, so even though you're Jesus, you so so basically, as far as dress was concerned, Kevin Kevin tried to dress me like, nah, man, I'm the nigga that shows up to a black. Hell, no, he did to you too. <laughs> He says, I'm that nigga. But see, he actually got me. I actually bought. He convinced me. He convinced me. I got a couple of real nice suits and, and, and everything like that. But you you strike me as the type of nigga that'll show up to a black tie event and a Thundercat shirt and be completely comfortable with that. Well, yes. Now, I do have a bunch of suits because I tell people when I had when I worked for IBM, I had a bunch of suits, but it's just blue and black. Sure. Uh, <laughs> right. I did buy it like, because they, they don't really play their cookie cutter. But then when I... Uh, when we went out on our own and we did Headhunter, I would have, you know, you have to meet with certain board people. So sure, I right. would have suits where you meet with them to just try to sell you on the idea of you guys need this this service of where we can provide to you guys these candidates. And they were like, what the fuck? So we were trying to sell them that <laughs> thing. And now it's a thing. Um, but I would had so I always had suits. So that's why when I went on the road, I had suits. But I hate suits. It's like it's so yeah. I, I I like it for a day. Sure, sure. Uh, but I don't like it for a lot of time. To me, uh, dressing up is like uh, caramel on, on ice cream. Oh, I, it's good oh. for a little while, but if you eat too much of it, it's just too fucking sweet. That's right. And they're like, who the fuck eats all of the caramel? Yes. I don't know that nigga. Nobody, nobody does. Nobody <laughs> does. 